proxy bouncing mask underneath mask so what exactly is proxy bouncing now proxy servers are fabulous however what if you really wanted to commit a perfect computer crime of course a perfect computer crime is a crime wherein the attacker which could be you never gets caught so what if you actually wanted to say imagine a scenario break into the fbi website and of course never get caught for it now all you need to do is before you actually commit a perfect computer crime you need to take certain important precautions first of all you need to go to a local internet cafe once you are at the local internet cafe you need to use that system to connect to a proxy server in a diplomatically unfriendly country like maybe russia once you are connected to the proxy server in russia you need to then use that system to connect to a second proxy server in yet another diplomatically unfriendly country like maybe north korea once you are connected to the second proxy server in north korea you need to use that system to connect to a third and final proxy server in yet another diplomatically unfriendly country like maybe iraq and once you have done that trust me take my word for it you could break into absolutely any website on the internet including fbi.gov and trust me chances are there's absolutely no way in which you can get caught because if you really think about it after taking all these precautions after following this particular procedure that we just discussed what is going to happen is when the fbi investigators go through the system records file of this fbi.gov server they will only get the ip address of the last proxy server that you use which is the proxy server in iraq so your ip address is still not known your identity is still not known and you just committed a perfect computer crime now let's assume that the fbi investigators actually want to trace the attack back further so now what they'll have to do is in order to trace the attack back further they'll have to get in touch with the local police agencies in iraq and maybe seek their cooperation and help to try and find out what your ip address is but of course due to the diplomatic problems between iraq and the us that's never going to happen so your identity is still not known your ip address is still not known and you just committed a perfect computer crime and let's is imagine a very unlikely scenario where in all different police agencies in iraq north korea and russia actually choose to cooperate with the fbi even in that case the attack will only be traced back to a random anonymous internet cafe in your city your identity is still not known your ip address is known but that's quite useless and you just committed a perfect computer crime so this technique of committing a perfect computer crime that i just described is actually often referred to as proxy bouncing and proxy bouncing is basically the phenomena wherein you connect to multiple different proxy servers before connecting to the actual destination system in other words each and every proxy server that you're connecting to will act as an additional mask which is hiding your previous identity and a very good software which i like to recommend to all of you which allows you to keep changing the proxy server that you're using within the same internet session is actually a software called multi proxy and this software is available as a free download of the internet not only that another very good software which i like to recommend to all of you which allows you to actually carry out proxy bouncing is a software called socks chain proxy now socks chain proxy is basically an application that allows you to connect to multiple proxy servers before connecting to the actual destination system and hence 